hero today. Checking. Ooh, that's a good song. All right. Happy Sunday morning, everybody. Checking out this new uh, Game Freak game, which is not Pokemon. Crazy. Uh. Oh, yeah, it's showing. Might have to move the camera around a little bit after we get started. But uh, yeah, I saw um saw somebody on my following list that was playing this. Watched just a just a little bit of it. it looked pretty interesting, so I I did some some research on it and. Uh, yeah, it looked pretty cool. Twenty five bucks, fairly fairly cheap game. This boy is the main character. Please give him a name. Where did you pull that from? This is my village. Everyone here is nice. The food's great. It's peaceful. I couldn't ask for more. Except... We can't go outside the village. It's been that way since before I was born. It's a promise the villagers made with the people in the castle who protect us. only way to get out of the village is through the castle. That's why I want to go in. If I can talk to the ones inside, maybe they'll let me out on an adventure. The pants on fire was yesterday. This is my mom. Got him in trouble too, so say sorry to him. Hear that? Don't be late for work. Chapter one. Ooh. 
This is my buddy Nails. No matter what happens, I can always count on him to be my partner in crime. Tutorial time! I guess I'm following nails. Like, you want some. Leo, you're late. This is Matic. He's, uh, you know what? He doesn't need an explanation. This is Angard, a real soldier from the castle. I'm gonna train with him so I can become a soldier at the castle, too. How do we get him to help us? I'll tell you later. Let's start the training already. Alright, so this will be a good spot to figure out cam settings and... Alright, let us begin. thing that just floated above your head is called a... is it? An is it is an idea that you can use in battle, but at the moment it's just a possibility you can't use it yet. To utilize it in battle you need to be sure of it, so we need to confirm it's what you want to do. Press the A button. That's it. Now your idea has substance. This is called a Dazit. To change an is it into a Dazit, you need power. There's a limit to how much power you have for each turn, so choose where you want to use your power wisely. In this game, you fight by colliding Dazits with each other. Try it out and see for yourself. Press the A button. I think I can actually turn this down a little bit. Bang! There now you know how Dazits collide. You also just visit, witnessed your Dazit break. Each Dazit has an attack and a defense value. When Dazits collide, the attack will damage the opponent's defense. Once the defense value reaches zero, the Dazit gets broken. Let's proceed to the next turn. As the battle progresses, Leo will come up with new Izzets and power will also be replenished. Let's try using a Dazit that won't get broken this time. This one won't get broken, I don't think. One attack versus one defense, or two defense. Very good, you've managed to keep your Dazit unbroken. Dazits that survive the turn are able to be used again next turn. The turn will continue till the enemy exhausts all Dazits it has. You will need to throw Dazits back till the turn is over. You can see your opponent still has one Dazit left. You also have one idea left, so you'll have to use it.
Oh no, he broke me. In this turn, it's possible to break all of your enemy's dazits. How so? This Dazit might be better used against a different enemy Dazit. So that, break, that broke one, but um, I don't know how... And that broke me too. Oh, he's out now. He's... okay. Perfect, you've broken all of the enemy's dazits. This is called, oh, okay, so a turn doesn't end until everybody's out of uh, izits, I think. When you all break, you get an opportunity to attack again in what is called a chance turn if you have an idea that can attack left. That might be a little confusing, I'll rephrase it a little. An all break will lead to a chance turn if you have a dazit you can use left. That it's the same exact thing you said before. Uh, you get to attack the enemy's body instead of an enemy Dazit. If you break all the hearts the enemy body has, you win. Now let's continue attack using the idea you have left. Okay, so one attack takes away one heart. Well, that's easy enough. I think I can move my cam down to there. Might be able to make it a little bit bigger. Hmm, not bad at all. Looks like you have an act for coming up with new ideas. That's a must for a soldier. Right, what are we doing next? Let me take a rest for a moment. Yeah, it's just because you got whooped up on. Didn't I say what well, you must learn some patience? Anyhow, just be sure you remember our promise. It was just yesterday. Try and remember it. Uh, yesterday. came out of the castle right when I was about to go in. firework in your butt. Hey, that soldier looked impressive. He's probably ranked pretty high up. Oh, really? 
Break stuff? No? Hmm. Bumped into Pasmina? She's my childhood friend. Nice girl, but a bit of a nag. Minor M I N O R. <laughs> My mom wanted a bullhorn to yell out her with. Just remember, don't go into the tavern. Okay. Leo, make sure you don't go inside the tavern. Okay, mom. As I was saying, Mr. Soldier, surely a soldier as cool as you could easily bring me in the castle. Yeah, see, they spelled minor correctly here, but they didn't spell it correctly earlier. Unless I'm actually, like, a minor. Maybe that's my job. Leo. I just want to see the world outside. The outside world isn't a playground, it can be cruel. could bring you out there. I can go outside if I become a soldier. Give me a break, kids. I'm very, very busy right now. Busy drinking? Fine, I'll train you. But only under one condition you must help me with my mission. What mission? Fighting monsters. Monsters? You mean... That's right, those monsters with teeth and hair. exist in fairy tales. How do we fight them? Do you see the problem? We can't. 
means I'm on an everlasting mission, or so they'd have me think. What do you mean? I've been banished from the castle under a false pretense. Sounds like grown-ups have to deal with a lot. Been banished? Great, that means you'll have tons of time to train us. So, he's been banished to fight monsters that don't exist. But you just said that monsters don't exist. What I need you to do is simple. I'm sure someone from the castle will come to buy check in on my mission. All you have to do is tell them I bravely slayed all the monsters. Everyone. Easy enough, isn't it? Well, if there are no more monsters, that'd be a job well done, wouldn't it? They'd have to let me back in the castle. Then who would train us after? Don't worry, I'll visit the village sometimes to train you, I promise. Okay. Since we still have time until they come to check on your mission, can you train us now? But I'm a bit drunk now. Let's do it tomorrow. Hey, Ken. Uh, just started. Just started. This is, uh... Yeah, not even on the, the second mission. Just got done with, I guess, a little tutorial thing. So... from the castle shows up, I just gotta say you bravely took down a monster. Exactly. Now that you remember, let's continue our training. You've only been attacking so far, but fighting isn't that simple. There's a lot more you need to do. First and foremost, defense. You need to learn how to protect yourself properly. Talk to me when you're ready. Alright, tutorial number two. Look, a different colored idea has appeared. Ideas come in three colors, red, yellow, and blue. The red's attack, yellow is block, I don't know what blue is. Yellow dazits act as shields. As long as they aren't broken, they can be used multiple times. However, they cannot inflict damage during a chance turn. Even if your enemy has many ideas and it looks as if they have the upper hand, it's quite possible to get an all break if you use your yellow dazits well. Give it a try. Alright, I guess we're using proper guard. Alright, so I think we want to use this to get rid of his light jab. And then we'll have the block left over but we're both broke I don't understand well done now you know how to use yellow dazzits look it's a blue idea Blue Dazzits can be used anytime and don't need to collide with enemy Dazzits to take effect. They hold various special effects that may help you during battle. For example, All Break can be achieved easily by using Pelt in this turn. However, you don't want to waste any leftover power. So change the proper guard is it into a Dazzit before using Pelt against the enemy. Deals one damage to all enemy Dazits. But saying use this first. This is one Dazit you want to keep. Oh, okay. Never mind. But this should take out all his. 
Okay. But I but then I can't attack with uh, the yellow one. It's a clever tactic to use up your power on Izzets before the next turn, even if you don't need to use them as Dazzits yet. Holy moly, I'm confused. A red dazzit is used solely to attack. Unlike a yellow dazzit, it can be used once per turn. Change the hard hit, is it, into a Dazzit and keep it till the chance turn to see how it works. Oh, okay. So you can load this up. Okay, so the number in the middle is how much it'll cost to actually do the ability, I guess. This would take out his light jab, maybe? Unique battle system, very, um, very different. I still don't 100% know what all I'm doing here. Very good, you're a fast learner. I already feel stronger. Like you even know the difference between what's it and do's it. Yeah, he's right. For Angard, it's my turn. Please teach me the ways of the warrior. Hey, wait, I can still keep going. Alright, let me just fight Maddox. That's obviously what's going to happen here. But we just started. I'm not tired at all. Mom. has been unlocked. Leo is in a hurry. The travel icon is useful at times like this. Oh, I am a miner. I am actually a miner. Not just young, but also a coal miner. So they did spell it correctly. Okay. So fast travel is... Nope, that's wrong. You're late, Leo. Everyone's already here. Let's make it a good day. Oh, that's my dad. He went missing when I was a baby. I don't know the reason he left home. He just never came back. He wanted to see the world. He really did leave the village. The 
kid that tried to sneak into the castle the other day. That was you, wasn't it? That's me. I knew it, you little rascal. Okay. Let's go check out whatever, uh, what's happening here. Theo, wait a minute. Before I let you into work, I gotta ask, what are the three rules of mining? Hmm, what's going on? Read his mind. <laughs> Alright, I don't have the power to read people's minds. It's a it's a cute game so far. It's it's pretty uh it's had some pretty good humor so far. I can't let you in the mine unless you can say all three mining rules. I guess I'll just have to ask around. I used to when I went, but I can't remember anymore. Ha 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 ha. Wait, if he doesn't know, how does he get in? Wasn't it something like, take it easy, if you push yourself all the time, it can be tiring, you know? So we all gotta relax a little. Take it easy. Say hello. You can't be a decent miner if you can't even greet your team. Uh, where's the third one at? Go back outside and see. <laughs> Take rest. Alright, there we go. Sure do. You have to say hello. So what are the other two rules? Take it easy. Aw. <laughs> you jerk, that's not the that's not a rule at all. He's not in the mine. All right, what do you got? Work hard, not take it easy. I guess I might as well just ask. Mining is dangerous work. That's why before you dig, you gotta check your tools. Safety procedure. Alright, so say hello was the first one. That one's... We definitely got that one, right? Um, then we gotta choose from these others. I bet check your tools and work hard. Work hard, huzzah! Okay, man, good work. Let's call it for a day. This training will have to wait till tomorrow. <gasps> Loot! Booty! Heck is this some kind of redstone? 
the next day. There's a green stone. I've been feeling really energetic since yesterday, ever since I found that stone. I feel like I'm going to be able to become a soldier in no time. Oh, you look happy. Probably here on an important mission. Don't you go causing him any trouble. Um, I mean, there's, uh, I wonder, uh, was I supposed to talk to her before I left? Possibly. Just checking to see if there's anything to do other than just leave here. Um... I guess I'll just walk around until I got training. Oh, okay. Not that way. Oh, here we go. You're late again. I've got leagues stronger than you. Good that you have confidence, but being arrogant is dangerous. Please have mercy. <laughs> The camera is um, kind of inverted. 
a little bit. Alright, let's fight this dude. Oh, no, I'm ready. As you can see, when a battle starts, Leo will come up with five random ideas. To avoid receiving damage from Maddox attacks during this turn, try using Tight Guard to protect yourself. In the next turn, you'll come up with a new idea, but you'll have a total of five to work with again. Use Tight Guard to endure this turn. Oh, it costs three. So, yeah, that's the only thing I can do this turn. Did you notice the gauge in the middle of the screen rise? That's the energy level of the redstone Leo has. Once it's full, Leo gains one extra power to use in the following turns. Oh, that'd be cool. More abilities. So the more turns you fight, the more action Leo can take. At the end of each turn, there is a change of location. You will have to move one to four spaces within the area, which is decided by a roulette. Try pressing the A button. Okay, this is the location you will fight in this turn. Why do you change location? That's weird. Looks like you've come up with the idea dash card during this turn. Dash card has a special effect that works when you successfully break an enemy Dazit. Gain free mobility after the turn if enemy Dazit breaks. Sorry, my cam's kind of over that, that part in the bottom left. You have gained free mobility from the special effects of a dash guard. Free mobility allows you to choose your next location within range instead of having to move depending on the roulette. This becomes very important later. Please try to make good use, good use of it. Okay, so it seems like cam would work much better here. We'll just go ahead and take off uh, Pit Boss and Tip Cup. That way you can see what's in the bottom right. Seems to be important. The enemy only has one desert left now. Look like looks like an idea will help you achieve an all break. Go for it. Half chance of dealing one damage for 
receive attack directly. I don't think I want to do that. I guess maybe this one? To avoid a break? Then we get to do an attack? I think. You have just received one break point. EP is earned when you successfully achieve an all break, but don't have a red Dazzit to use in the chance turn. BP is useful in a pinch. We'll just keep it for now. Well, it's turning into time to change your location. You have free mobility now, so you get to choose which space you land on. You can choose to go back one to four spaces or move forward one space. Look, Nails is nearby. Nearby. Try moving to the space where he is in. like nails is going to support you in this battle when you fight in a location where a friend is you get their support press the l button to check what kind of support you can receive from them allows a random is it to be changed to a does it at zero cost oh okay Oh, so we actually could probably, um, might go to finish them off this turn, or did it say random? I should have did the four. I don't know why I didn't do the four. Just see what happens. Oh, what the F? I thought it did multiple damage. You will not beat this game too. You are correct. What's up, Malta? But this one is a lot shorter than all the other ones, so this one is only 15 hours as opposed to 80 hours. Manic is acting real tough, but he's got his weaknesses. Thanks, boy. Uh, what? All right, one more thing. Ideas disappear as they get broken and used up, so it's best to defeat your enemy as quickly as possible before you run out of ideas. However, whenever Leo receives damage to his heart, old ideas will get revived in his headspace. As long as you have hearts left, you should be fine. You were a character yesterday in Hat in Time? In Murder Mystery Park? Oh, really? Did I miss it? Was I badass? You know how many ideas you have left? You can always check your headspace. 
have a look in there sometimes to keep track of your ideas. All right, let's check out my headspace. Basically, we're looking in the uh, in the gutter here. Revive ideas. Okay. There is a lot going on in this game. We can actually... Gain one improv... Uh, plus one, plus zero... I end up being your pet's name. That seems to be the normal for me. the map thing I mean I, I know that you might run into one of your friends but it's it's very uh all right what does tough out do looks like you're doing all right here's a tip about using BP by using BP you can swap an idea into your headspace with one Leo already has you can also use it to revive ideas in your headspace when you're running out of them if you ever thought, oh, I wish I could use Pelt now. No, I'm out of ideas, but I can't afford to take damage. This is exactly when you should use your BP. Bopping and reviving ideas are done in your headspace. That's it. Good luck in battle. Yeah, it actually looks like... This looks like I'm going to take, if, if I do this, I will lose a heart. But it looks like I can eventually win if I do this. Yeah, find the part of it. All right, so this will break him. Ah! Oh no, did I mess up? Or can I use that ability, please? Maybe? Ah, dang it. Oh, because I didn't have enough Okay, I got it now. Is this dude damage enemies' hearts? Oh, okay. Let's just do that and win. That works. Even fight. Not bad, Leo. Was it really? Both of you did pretty well. Ouch, 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 ouch. My back. What if a monster comes while Mr. Angard is injured? He's in no shape to fight. I don't want to fight a monster even when I'm healthy. That was pretty impressive, Leo. You seem to have some kind of power. Power. 
Mom's calling. Sir, I hope it's not my son's fault that you're hurt. Well, this is embarrassing. Leah's blow was so strong it knocked me over. I think I can't work with an injury like this, so I was going to ask Leo to do my job for me. <laughs> Cooked your favorite dinner. Tacos. Your mom is the scariest when she suddenly turns so unnaturally sweet. Yo, is a doggo. is next yeah it's pretty good it's pretty good i must have been asleep for that i apologize i was probably napping you didn't have enough space for uncle leo hopefully one day there's an anti leo yeah yeah the correct phrase would be anti a-u-n-t-i-e Actually, I, you know what? I don't know. I guess that works. What's for dinner? Tacos. Tacos. We get some tacos. Think there's going to be dinner? Here comes the storm. How dare you, how dare you hurt that poor grown gentleman? Not enough spaces for anti Leo too. I'd quit that game. Gee, she's yelling so loud. It feels as if the ground is. Oh, there's monsters outside, isn't there? <laughs> hey, the ground really is shaking. It's an earthquake, Mom. I'm gonna go check out. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna check outside. What? What the heck is that? A monster! Mr. Angard, I thought you said monsters don't exist. It, it, impossible. Leo, run. I have to do this. It's my fault that Angard can't fight right now. Monster Hunter Stories! This is your first real battle with a monster. When you find a monster, you will find a guts parameter above your hearts. As long as you maintain your guts, damage cannot be inflicted to your hearts. However, your guts will receive the damage you take. Your enemy looks formidable, but you should be fine. Try to protect the village with what you've learned so far. Alright. Let's see here. Uh, this actually looks like a good one. This should be able to take up... Oh, he's got guts too. What? So the tight guard should be able to avoid everything. Oh. 
but I don't have any BP left after this. So I won't actually be able to attack him. Uncle Leo. Forgot his first name. It's a crush. Thank you for the raid. How did um Did you get to fight a did you get to fight any other bosses? Except for uh other than Mantis Lords? Oh, do I have a free move? Soul Master. You know, I played a little bit of that game, but I never, obviously, I never finished it because I never finished any game, so. This game is, uh, it's cute. It's cute. It's, it's got, there's a lot of humor with it. It's pretty funny. Um, and it's, it's a unique battle system. That's for sure. I think that was the main thing that they were trying to do. Was kind of create a different JRPG style battle system. Yeah, the music's not bad. Better finish all your game, all games on your 24-hour stream. That would be cool. Get everything set up to just finish, just knock out some games. It's rock, paper, scissors type of battle, kinda. But you can see what your opponent's gonna do. So he's about to throw a punch. That's one. I. You almost had to watch the tutorials to fully understand it. I don't know that I could properly explain it. Yeah, Punch has one strength, two defense. So this would break his, but his would break mine. There's a lot going on with it. Uh, and you have to, you're trying to figure out a way, so this would work, but it would use up all, this would work for both of his attacks, actually. I don't know. I, I guess we could use this and just build up BP so that maybe we get to actually attack him next turn. Yeah, sorry, there is no Leo command. <gasps> oh no. You know what? I goofed. I goofed. Oh crap, I'm going to take... I think I'm going to take damage here. Tough card blocks it? I can't cast tough card. I don't have enough power. So, the little uh, hexagons above my ability is how much, how much I have left. And I don't I used it all I thought I could use this again but I cannot so now I'm just kind of screwed so I think the only thing I can do is struggle and I'm gonna take damage against this I think I, can, I don't think I can improvise either yeah I don't have enough power that's the only thing I can do here.
Oh, why does his stuff do two damage? My stuff only did one damage. Man. Alright, well that was a... Uh, that turn was definitely a, a lesson in... So Tough Guard would block it, but it wouldn't break his ability. Um, Dash Guard would break it. And it only costs one. Let's do this. Don't let the monster reach town. Kind, I guess. Oh, you know what? I have a uh, support. So, after each turn, after all the idea bubbles are either gone from myself or him, we move to a different square on the in the town, and basically you have support characters sitting around the map that you kind of want to be near, I guess. Um, oh wait, can we use this? And that would save some? Oh, this is going to give me a headache. So I could... Uh, I'm just, um, there's probably like a really specific path that you're supposed to take with the abilities, and yeah, it's, um, so I only have one power left. I can't cast any of this stuff except for this because I've already, but the problem is I lose it. So now I won't have it for the next turn. And I couldn't cast anything. So it gave me an extra BP. But we've got a free move. So now we move to this square where she gives plus one, plus one to all Dazits. Thanks, Mom. When you begin to run out of ideas, a sign will appear next to the headspace icon. When the remaining number becomes zero, Leo can't come up with new ideas and can only struggle in battle. There are two ways to come up with new ideas. The first is Leo to receive damage to his hearts. The second is to use BP to revive ideas. You can revive ideas in your headspace if you have enough BP to cover the cost. Have a look to see for yourself. 
Remember, you'll get BP if you all break the enemy when you can't go into a chance turn. Uh... So, with this, I think the play, what? Thanks, Mom. So this takes out his punch, and it will also take out, if I can use it again, and I think I have enough left over to attack, maybe? Nice. Hey, man. Um, it's, it's interesting, that's for sure. It's, it's pretty funny. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have the big brain to uh, to be very uh, very good at this game. Oh no, that's a lot of abilities. Once you beat this game, your brain will be so big. enemy lose all special effects on their Dazits. Throw a Pokeball at him. He looks legendary. Oh, not enough power. Oh, no. Uh, oh, this works. Alright, so this will just be a turn where we get a BP out of all this, I guess. Once you use an idea and pay the orange cost, it can be used again at no cost but will break. What does the POW... Um, I think whenever it reaches full, maybe you get an extra... I don't remember that part of the tutorial. Three damage to one enemy Dazit or enemy's guts gain one idea. Allows a random is it to be changed to a Dazit at zero cost.
Oh, okay. Um, let's do... Let's do this. Red deserts can only be used once per turn, but can be used as a chance. Oh, that wasn't the one I wanted. All right, well, this will work because we'll have destroy after all this to actually attack him this turn, so. can be used any number of times. Nice. Yeah, what does PAL do? Oh, it looks like it changes the number of, um... See, this would get rid of the punch here. That's all it would do. I could use that as well. All right, let's try this. Kind of a waste. Oh, that this helps. Yes, this helps. No, it doesn't. That doesn't help at all. Actually, it kind of does, I think. So for this... Thank you for the follow. Hello. I don't think it actually matters. charge you can get a hit in
adds hard guard. Oh, I can't move to his square. Okay. Um. That's fine. I mean, it's something, I guess. Get intimidated by his size. Oh, I can't swap anything. Oh, no. All right. Well, uh, let's see. break the guard with I don't think it actually does I don't think it actually does like this so that at least I have one ability left. But he's got guts. So... Alright, so now I can do this. Ah, oh, crap. Why does he have... So this will leave this this one left over. Gain free mobility so we can go to that, that dude's square to see what he can help us with. Oh, never mind. I guess I used it that turn, so I can't use it. got a hard guard so that's that's good um oh but it costs five Cover three guts, so uh, we'll go ahead and use it. Angar deals two down. Oh, oh yeah, it does. I forgot to check that. We kind of wasted that. We probably could have just went ahead and uh, won, I guess. Wait, no, we couldn't have.
Turn 10. How many turns can we go? Uh, Pelt would be awesome right now. Pelt would be great. Sucker Punch deals two to all. I need. To, I guess I need to start paying attention to the bottom of uh, bottom left down here. Braces all enemy idea special effects and deals two damage to all. Wow. Okay. Uh, I'll try to start reading that. Wow, that's really good. No! Hey, Ray. So much to keep up with in this game. Whew. I think I beat it. But that was a monster. Hey, Matic helped. Even though he's our rival. Then you can fight the next one. This is a monster to think they really exist. It's not moving, is it dead? Yeah, what could Monster Hunter What can they make a Monster Hunter game like this for Switch? Instead of uh 3DS and uh mobile. Instead of MHGU. Such a horrible game, Kappa. The adventure I hoped for never began. Instead, strange things started had to happen in my village. You've been playing this game. It's pretty decent. It looked interesting, definitely. We're already done with chapter one. I guess I'd never saved. It is um, certainly a different game. Thank you. 
Ray Reviewer, thank you for that uh, follow. To think monsters really exist. Yeah, it was scary, but we pulled through and won somehow, right? Y'all, don't be looking at my mom like that. Not sure how it works, but as long as I have the stone, I'm really strong. What if you're wrong and you get hurt? So one of the reasons I wanted to pick this up was they said no grinding. So that sounded like a different kind of RPG right there than the ones that we have been playing. Octopath, Xenoblade, Dragon Quest XI. So that sounded pretty cool. I did turn off my camera for a personal grind. Here is bitter that you got to be the hero for the day. If Leo can do it, so can I. No big deal. And that is a lesson for all of you out there. If Leo can do it, all of you can. It's no big deal. Everybody in the chat, that's your life lesson right there. That Leo achievement is one that nobody should ever be able to unlock. Nobody ever wants to unlock that one. But he's here to praise us for our heroics, right? Find the minister. Move! Oh, how do I get up there? Okay, fine game. I was er surprised monsters exist. Promise you'd report to the people from the castle I defeated the monster. Well, you don't have to do that anymore. Aww. I asked you to do so because I didn't think they existed. But they do. And you're the one that defeated it. That is the honest truth. I'm not so dishonest as to take somebody else's credit. I just want to return to the castle. Now that there are no more monsters, I should be able to. As a reward for beating the monster, you think they'll let me be a soldier? He's by the shops. Not only was I injured by a child, but you ended up completing my mission too. That's not something to be proud of. So I can't go meet him like this. I need to think of an excuse for why I couldn't fight first. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to... Uh, whatever this is. Can you see the icon? Yes, I can. It means she has a quest for you. 
There are two types of quests in this game, the main quest and the sub quest. The red icons have to do with the main quest, blah, 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 blah. You get a nice reward when you do. Yeah. If only I could try on clothes at the general store. But I'm too shy to go in alone. It's a date. Let's go another day. Is this like uh, Dragon Quest XI? <laughs> it is. <laughs> okay. Someday we're going to go together. There. That's how you receive a subquest. Most subquests can be completed in later chapters, but a few can only be completed within the chapter. You can check out you can check on the progress of your quest by accessing the quest menu through the X button. This chapter has several subquests you can start. It could be fun to walk around and search for them. Care to listen to a story? Oh, okay. <laughs> the story I'm about to tell you is a slice of history about this village. You know the commercial area where all the shops are? I'm not gonna read all this. Down the coal mines, people started moving here, and the population increased. That led to the development of the village. All right, I lied. I'm going to read it all. used to be a vast field of grass. Only wild animals and insects live there. Now it's all fixed up so we can keep sheep and chickens and grow our own vegetables. I said that was a side quest. I didn't get any, uh... I didn't get any rewards from it. Hold it. I'm sorry, but I cannot let you pass. The road is closed for now. You have to come back and listen to his other stories later. In the second game... Golden Sun is. You're that kid that tried to sneak into the castle. Soldier doesn't look like he's gonna let us through easily. We need a plan. He said he's hungry, right? Maybe we can use that to our advantage. Hmm. 
Hmm. Here for some cheese? Shop sells seven different kinds of cheese. Can I buy some? Learn the keyword cat food and lore. It's Taylor. She owns the general store. Maybe I can use smell as part of my plan. Trying to sneak into the castle again. Uh, I don't think this is the way we want to go, but I'm going to do it anyway. Maybe now that we have some of these keywords, we might be able to go um, some of these other places here. Yeah. <laughs> if his pants are on fire, he must be telling the truth. in here. I climb this. Nope. Alright. Let's see if any of these keywords uh, do anything now. It does not. Okay. Mom will make me some tacos. The inverted camera. <clears throat> I 
Well... We can go check out this uh, other side quest here real quick. Oh, the game locked up there for a second. Jeez, Crush. Good luck in the outside world, man. Prefer sleeping in the field? That wheat, that wheat looks awfully comfortable, no doubt. It's not a prank, why do you keep talking to the scarecrow? Visualizing. Oh, another keyword. It's a form of image training. You mentally prepare yourself for battle by playing it out in your head. You should do it sometimes. Now stop talking to the scarecrow. You're scaring the villagers. can now visualize using the scarecrow. Visualizing can help you gain Eureka points. It's worth trying out every once in a while. What should I do? I don't want to know. I don't want to do this. Whose idea was this? This is where you can try out ideas. So I can leave this and it won't it won't matter, right? Okay. Quit it. Quit it. So I guess after you finish more monsters, maybe you could Try out your ideas against different monsters. I'm 
Sometimes upgrading an idea adds a new effect. You try them out there. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Well, right now... Maybe if I just go talk to the soldier again now, maybe something will happen. Have I talked to you already? to talk to. Cat food. Um, does it matter? Okay, I, I kind of get it now. know what a curry quit is curry kit I'm hungry because I'm using my mother's secret recipe When I was little, my country went to war, so we were forced to run away. On our travels, we found that castle, and we live here now. Also gain new support characters and gimmicks. Sorry if anybody's trying to read it. I uh, <clears throat> wasn't even really thinking there, and I was just kind of flipping through it. <laughs> I just remembered about an emergency. And you look like an honest, strong young man, fit for the job. Please, won't you stay in guard and keep people from passing through?
Just one thing. Whatever you do, do not go down the path. <laughs> How did Angar get there? So I pretended to be injured to trick the monster to letting his guard down. When he did, my great disciple Leo dealt the finishing blow. See, very impressive, Angard. Indeed. About letting me return to the castle. Did you notice anything during your fight with the monster? Next mission, we need to just stay out here and find out how the monster entered the village. I didn't know you were just pretending to be hurt. That's great. <laughs> Weren't your parents worried that you did something so dangerous? Leo gives away a little bit too much. Okay, so I guess we can go back and do that little side quest that uh, we saw before. Thought I could return to the castle once the monster was defeated, and now they want me to find where it's from. Do you know of any secret exits from this village, any place the monster could have snuck in? Where we wouldn't be here. Let's split up and search the area. has the power to take on something like that. <laughs> you can find me at the tavern. At least while I'm drunk anyway. I I actually wasn't expecting uh, this stuff in between battles. I don't know why I wasn't expecting that, but I wasn't actually expecting a lot of this. But it makes sense to piece together the fights and all that stuff, so. You can use it to strengthen Leo's ideas. Access it through the main menu. Uh, 
Um... Oh. It kind of feels like these, um... Can we, can you skip some and just go to... Doubt it. Okay, root. Okay, yeah. I don't really, uh, I don't know a whole lot about the, uh, the abilities there, but, um, oh, crap. I was going to go do the side quest real quick. Allows a random is it to be changed to a Dazit cost of zero. Plus one. Oh, that's not bad. Either way, this was the idea that I was going to do, so that's good that we have the, um, oh, we'll actually get an attack this way. RNG in this game, huh? Bet in some of the later fights might be kind of frustrating. Oh, here we go. Oh, 
Oh well. I really need to start paying attention to what these things do to the other the other assets and all that stuff. If y'all can hear it, but the audio kind of screws up every now and then. I mean, I think this is, I think we're good here, I believe. Sweet, so that gives me another Eureka point. Why can't I win? Is it the same as the protection stones we have all over the town? Like those? I don't see any stones in this one. I see regular stones. Only miners can go in. get home before mom gets mad um so maybe they're getting in through the coal mines asmina I, I don't know how to say it needs your help at the farm today head over there and help her out won't you i'm a bit worried about Matic, but i can't get scolded by mom again guess i'll do what i'm told all right, Mom, I'll go help out. <clears throat> Remember to help me with the chores, too. How does she know about my plan? <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, maybe we can do this side quest now. Maybe I can't. I guess this game is on rails.
It's a monster. Uh, this way. Not fast travel. Oh, is this not the farm? What? Oh, this camera is giving me fits. Get out of my way. Oh, there's the form. Background there. Good morning, Leo. That's Trula, Maddox's little sister. Unlike Maddox, she's a good kid. Did you see where Maddox went? <laughs> but definitely not at the coal mines. I'll try to speed through shearing and go find him. Sheep's gonna turn into a monster, though. something weird again. got a problem. I tried to shear the sheep, but they suddenly went wild. I'd riot too if I had to eat granny's food every day. Could try talking to Uno. He's sort of the leader of the sheep, so if you can get him, everyone else might follow. That one, the energetic one. They all look energetic to me. When they bump into the fence, they get surprised and slow down. Get it? After they bump into the fence, that's your chance to talk to them. Oh, he hit that thing hard. Oh! <laughs> I'm, I'm... What?
It's gotta be Uno, but he seems mad. So I guess, I guess the other ones just wouldn't let you talk to them. What? To calm the sheep down, you need to shear them. By repeatedly having an all brick, Leo will eventually come up with the idea to shear. Try to shear the sheep during a chance turn. Reverts everything back to its status in the beginning of the turn. So, with this one, I can't use the General Guard twice? What? Well, now, I are confused. Oh, I get it. I get it. He's got a special ability on Fluff. That's what it is. Alright, we got it this time. Changes a uh, it changed my daz it back into an is it so I had to pay for it twice to be able to use it. going to do the fluff again. Leo has come up with the idea shear. Be mindful of the ideas the sheep has so you can choose ideas that can break them. Your aim is to use shear in the chance turn. Alright. Break an enemy's dazzit. That one, the good looking one. Alright, she's just trying to get me to, to shear all of the sheeps. Nope. Oh, they're hitting each other. Put it. Oh, you can actually, you could change your direction so they go into the fence, I guess. Maybe, kinda, a little bit. No. 
Alright, here we go. Oh, well, that's not the right one. Uh, maybe... Oh, that's a... Dang it. It's gotta be... Oh, here we go. It's saying catch, 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 catch. It won't let me catch. Alright, here we go. Oh, he, he's angry too. So I guess these little uh, mini battles, maybe there's only one way to shear a sheep. Leo doesn't have many ideas, but effects of the sheep's fluff could be used to your advantage. So we've got our shear now. Allows one is it to be used at zero cost. Okay. So you turn that into a and then the only one that can it could possibly do is swipe away. Nice. Okay. I guess it's just gonna make me do all three of the sheep, all four of the sheep, I guess. This is messed up, making me do all the sheep shearing.
The run button. Now I know he's in there. Oh, he's got the evil green one. He's gonna beat me up now. and save the sheep. Uh, can I travel? Alright. What's the point of having to travel? my back. Oh, don't be messing with Granny's food now. What the heck did you feed him? Alright, so he, he still has that 
fluff ability. Starting this battle, gimmicks placed on the field can be used. A gimmick is something that can assist you during battle like the cannon over there. Gimmicks have various effects depending on how you use them. You could change the outcome of the battle quite drastically. To use a gimmick, you need to use the required Dazzit to trigger it. Once you use up the Dazzit, it can't be used again in the turn. Choose when to use your gimmicks very carefully. You can check the details of the gimmick by pressing the L button. Just like support. Use Slam to deal 3 damage to enemy's body. Uh, what? Oh, I don't have slam. Oh, or maybe, uh, will it automatically just work? Oh, no, it won't work. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Gain one improvised idea. Let's see here. What is stuff out is the one that gains plus one. All dazzits. We currently have what does struggle do? made that sheep real pretty. Oh, my brain. Come on, there's gotta be a way I can figure this out. Um, so I can do, I can do destroy and throw, but that gets rid of both of those. This would not work. Um. Let's just uh, let's just do it this way, I guess. What can you do, and what bonuses do you get? Yeah, there's there's a plus one there, and I thought about that, but I don't I don't think that would work. So basically, at the end of this turn, we'll just gain a uh, we'll gain a BP. Oh, this, this would work. Wouldn't break, but it would break me. 
think this works. No, because he's got fluff. Dang it, Bobby. I think we're gonna take damage on this one if I if I use if I use this it'll take his bite down to one. I only get three mana for the whole turn. That's what your that's what that pal meter is at the bottom. So as the battle goes on, it'll go up to four, and then I think we got it up to five our last battle. That's what that pal meter is. Um You don't get correct, but I can use the yellow ones over and over again. The problem is the fluff will take that away. Um, so I, I can use this with one of these, but that's not going to do anything. I don't think. I could try my luck with an improvise and see if anything comes from that. Uh, I guess I guess I might as well use this tough out game plus went on as it's yeah problem is I have to activate uh, yeah I'd have to activate this one it would be gone. Oh, my brain. It hurts. All right, well. I think the current situation, no matter what, I'm going to take a damage. Sight guard will break it right away. First. Plus two, plus zero to one random Dazit when made into a Dazit. I don't have any Dazits up currently. I only have Izits up currently. All right, let's do this. Let's see what we get. Breaks enemy's chosen Dazit. Adds plus one plus zero times the total number of yellow dials. I'll give you no break this turn. I wish I could go back and see what I have. I already forgot.
Um, I feel like this is a waste. I don't know. Let's just see what happens. No, that was dumb. That was... That was dumb. Yeah, that was dumb. <laughs> oh, well. Got any any good environmental things here? No. We do have slam now. Oh, you're doing a spelunky run? So we've got a pelt. We actually have a slam as well. 